This is what makes the NBA really hard to watch. Now, this is obviously a mismatch that the players should score easy against Paul. Paul's my size. Paul pushes him. He's about to hook him here. Now, watch this move that, that he does. Now, he fouls him. Still fouling him. And the guy, it looks like he did this on purpose, too, to give, it, give, give the ball up. Well, watch Chris Paul hook his arm and pull the player down, and they called the foul. Look, look at Chris Paul. See how he's hooked his arm, and he's dragging the player down on top of him? Did you see that? And they called a foul on the guy. Let's watch it again. Pushing, holding, pushing, holding, grabbed his arm, grabbed his arm. I think the guy just let this ball go to be a turnover. I think they told him in the year to do a turnover. See? The guy's buying. And oops, he just forgot the ball. Looks like he, see how he kind of put the ball behind his back? Now watch Chris Paul and the guy. Chris Paul grabs his arm and pulls him down. See, the guy's got, look, look at Chris Paul. Chris Paul grabs his arm and pulls him down. See that? And they called the, the foul on, on the guy in the white for the Nuggets. When this was clearly a foul by Chris Paul. And a lot of people say that's old veteran play. And then, and then they let that number seven for the Nuggets play. That, that's just such insult to all the players in America. This was, was just a dirty veteran play. Look at that. And, and, and he kind of puts the ball behind his back. Look at him kind of put the ball behind his back to give it, give the turnover up. Kind of puts it behind his back. Look at Chris Paul. Instead of Chris Paul disengaging with the player, he wants a foul. So Chris, Chris Paul grabs his arm and pulls him down on top of him. See that? In the foul, they call the foul on the player in the white. This is just what makes it such a poor, poor product. This kind of globetrotter play. And he's like, yeah, I get the call. My veteran move got him. This was so just globetrotterish. 